Hey guys, so today we're starting off with a 20 minute EMOM and then we've got some small AMRAPs to follow. So the first 20 minute EMOM we're looking at 14 down ups in the first minute, 14 seated strip press in the second, 14 meter box crawl and then 14 front squats to finish. So you're going through that for five rounds. Once you've done that you're moving on to the AMRAPs so they're each three, minute long, three minutes long with two minutes rest in between. So the first one is 18 squats, uh, 12 push ups and then six tap jumps. The second AMRAP is 18 hollow rocks, 18 hollow flutter kicks, and then 36 jumping jacks. And then the last one is 10 meters with a five meter sprint shuttle, and then five bodyweight man wakers to finish. Your warm up today, you've got two rounds, 10 Kang squats, 10 hip 90s, and then 10 side plank rotations. And then we're just gonna finish off with some, uh, some up and downward dog movements. So starting off with a Kang squat, 10 reps, hands behind the head, you're gonna push the hips back, and then lower into your squat, and then reverse it up, hips up and through. Sweet. Once you've done 10 of those, moving on to the hip 90-90s, so taking a seated position down on the floor, planting the feet down on the ground, you're gonna drop each knee to the floor, and just open up and then switch, and do the same on the other side. You're just working through 10 reps of those. Once you've done that, coming into a side plank rotation. So you can either do this up on the palm or you can come down onto the forearm if you need a little bit more help. And you're just gonna reach through and come up. Reach through and come up. You do five on one side and then switch and do five on the other side. Once you've done that, moving on to up and down with dogs. So you're starting your upward dog position and then pushing back into your downward dog. Just taking your time on these and using it as an active stretch. Once you've done the warm-up we're moving on to the EMOM so 14 down ups to begin with, hips and chest coming down to the ground and then standing tall at the top. So 14 minutes of those are working for about 40 seconds, depending on how fast you can get through them. Then you're looking at seated strip press. So sit down, feet out in front. If you've got two weights, fantastic. If not, you can just go for the single and switch arms. So starting with it in the front rack, you press it up and down. Cool. So making sure that you keep that midline nice and tight and that you're not relaxed through the spine. So sit up nice and straight and press through. There's seven on each side if you've only got a single weight. Once you've done that, we're moving on to the box crawl. Come down onto the ground, shins parallel to the floor, moving opposite arm, opposite leg, keeping the back in that nice flat tabletop position. And then finally moving on to your front squats. So weight sitting in between the forearm and the bicep. Elbow stays high to support the weight and then sending the hips back and down. Sweet. So five rounds of that guys and then we'll move on to the smaller arm wraps. So the first one, three minutes long, 18 air squats, just like we just did. Hips back and down, stand tall at the top. Moving on to your push-ups. So keeping the arms nice and straight at the top, drop the chest down to the deck. Push back up. If we need to, we can drop down to the knees. But still making sure that you move in the same range of motion, so not leaving the hips too high. And then moving on to your tuck jumps, so jumping the knees up into the chest for the six reps. So that's your first down wrap. We then get a two minutes rest period, and then we're moving on to the second one. A little bit more core dominant on this. So you've got hollow rocks, the lower back and bum in contact with the floor, just simply rocking back and forward. Once you've done those, you're gonna hold and then pedal the legs. And then move on to those jumping jacks for 36 reps. In now. And then finally moving on to the last one. So you've got your burpee with a shuttle. So now hips, chest down. When we do the jump and clap, I would then sprint my five meters, do my burpee that end, and then sprint back. Once you've done 10 reps of those, moving on to the bodyweight man makers. So coming down, 
to the ground, push up, tap the shoulder, push up, tap the shoulders, jump and clap. And you've got five reps of those to work through. Once you've finished the arm wraps all the way through, you are finished for the day. Hope it all goes okay, guys. Any questions, give us a shout.